Hello everyone, welcome back to a, another episode of the Kincade Legacy. It is a not bright and early, it is a dark and gloomy 5 a.m. and we have Knox here um, going out for a little jog. Uh, he's active despite like his, what it, like his affinity for junk food. He likes to get out, he likes to jog sometimes, and he hadn't really gotten a chance in the last episode. Um, so I have him out here torturing himself by jogging in the rain. It's not too bad though, he'll be fine, I'm sure. Um, but yeah, we are back and um, I'm really excited for this episode. Um, <gasps> Oh no. I mean, wait. Okay. So our bills just came in. You have two weeks until your household property taxes are due. The current estimated cost is $4,282. This value may increase over time. Um, that's no good. How much money do we have in like our actual, like our bills account? Okay. So between the bills account and what we have in like our normal household funds we should have enough especially after two weeks um but i don't know what we're gonna do after that because part of the reason why they even had that much money is because of the like you answer the phone call get two thousand dollars you know what i'm talking about what is this it's rebate day no but anyway in the last episode um we kind of ended off at the what is it like they went out to a little barbecue we're actually going to do something like that again soon because freedom day is coming up uh but uh in the meantime i kind of skipped ahead a few days played through a little bit off cam Knox actually finished his first semester of school and i was really worried because i thought that he uh would just completely fail uh he got like a notification from his professors saying that he was on the cusp of failure and that he really needed okay. to step up if he was going to like actually pass their classes so at the very least i thought he was going to get like c's or something c's or d's um but he actually got all a's in all three of his courses so i'm shocked and happy about that um so he's doing well let's have him actually i think he's done all his homework no okay so he's done all his homework let's have him work on one of his presentations i have to put it out on the porch because there's like no room in the house at all um, at least it's covered so it won't get destroyed by the rain but yeah he has a a plus gpa thank the lord for that and then if we go over to amaya and look at her not that look at this group that i made her um i i did figure out that um we can like invite people over and then have and then like offer to massage them and then hopefully we can do the same with their nails once she gets her wellness skill up i, t I think level six is what she needs and she's like over halfway there, just like barely over halfway there, um, which I'm really excited about. But yeah, so right now she is just doing massages. Um, and this this is in my mind, like her client list, like the people that will come in and like get massages from her. So of course we have our girl Jacqueline, we have our girl Cassidy, our neighbor. Um, and then, you know, some random townies. We have Gina, I don't know who Gina is. We have Dominic Friars and moira fryers fryers yeah anyway so that is what's been going on with these two amaya do you want to like put some clothes on if you're gonna be out on the porch like this girl Alrighty. so amaya has um she's working from home today so today she has to Promote a venue, travel to a non-residential venue, and then cross-promote using the phone's business app. Maybe we can actually go to the spa, since she still has to go to the spa, what, 11 more times, I think? Ooh. Um, yeah, so we can go to the spa today, uh, cross-promote there. I don't, should we bring someone? Should we go with, like, a friend? 
you know, no, let's just do our own thing. We'll have, Knox doesn't have work today. Um, he can, like, take care of Janae. He can hopefully fix their clothing line. Um, and then Amaya is, like, okay, basically going awesome. to work today. And then we just got our notification for Freedom Day, which will be tomorrow. I'm very excited. Um, because I think I, I didn't really get to introduce their families too much in the last episode. So that's what I want to do today. I'm really excited about that. But, um, alright, it's 10 a.m. So let's head off to the spa. Okay, so we also need to... I'm not super worried about whether or not she gets promoted in this career it's kind of just like in my mind it's kind of just her promoting her business you know she's not a simfluencer so much as she is like a small business owner who promotes herself using simstagram um but i don't know it would bring in a little bit more money until we can like get her own business off the ground so we need just like one more point in the entrepreneurial career so we're not quite there yet but we we will be hi my name is amaya would you like a massage perfect okay follow me or i'll follow you um <laughs> you know she's just got she's just got her like customer service vibe on today cassidy what we're at work <gasps> hey amaya i think i have a crush on orturo cast Danida, I hope I said <laughs> Do you think it's worth a try? Amaya's gonna say, yes, girl, go for it, you know. Go go after what you want. Live live your true life, live your true self, you know. <laughs> okay, so ooh, we're almost at a thousand dollars. Let's see if we can make let's see if we can get up to a thousand dollars today. Is he going to pay us? Okay. So no one is tipping right now. Which isn't optimal. Do we feel like Nancy Landgrab would be the kind of person to tip? Oh. Maybe not if we're like squeezing the life out of her hands, you know? Ooh, okay, so Nancy actually did. Nancy tipped Amaya $80. That's so good. Thank you, Nancy. Oh, we appreciate that so much. Okay, Amaya is getting extremely stinky and nasty. She's a little bit hungry. Uh, let us go home. Yeah, we've gotten a little over $1,000, which I'm really happy about. We only need to promote ourselves like three more times um and i think we can promote ourselves like once a day it just says like not to promote yourself too much but i assume that means like we do it once a day that's what i've been doing um we can come back to the spa a few more times just to like you know fulfill this spa regular thing and then have a regular client and give them 10 wellness paid services yeah, I don't, I wish it would, like, keep track of how many times we, like, helped a specific customer, because I'm not sure how many times she needs to do that before she can actually get it. I know that Jacqueline is one of our, like, main people, and then Cassidy is another one, but, um, yeah, I don't know, that is something maybe I should have been keeping track of, but I have not, um, so we'll get that one whenever we get that one. <laughs> oh my god. Ah. Guys, we have come home and it is thunderstorming. Maya's going to run inside the house. Uh, but let's hope she doesn't get struck by lightning. Um. <laughs> what are you doing, baby girl? Hello? affection we are going to kiss our baby girl give her let's blow a raspberry you know just say hi because we yeah amaya's been out at work like all day oh scooping up our little baby oh our little teddy bear Mwah. oh she's so precious she's so cute 
What is Knox doing? What? First word, milestone unlocked. Sul sul, dag dag, llama. No one can quite agree on which was said first, but make no mistake, Jay ha Janae has just started to speak her first words. Oh my god. Hello, she's so cute. Oh, wait, which one of them has the camera? Okay. Take a photo right now, please, sir. I don't know if I mentioned this. I don't think I mentioned this in the last episode. I got them. Maybe he should move to a place where he can see her. I got them a camera so that they can just like take pictures, you know, family photos, things like that. And we can just like have a little photo wall um, to kind of look back on all of our time together. You know what I mean? Okay, I was going to practice crawling with Janae, but she is actually sleepy tired um, and it is getting late. So we are going to put Janae to bed. Yeah, so uh, I know I mentioned this yesterday, but we are actually going to the park tomorrow for Freedom Day. Uh, it says that they have work. I mean, Knox doesn't work on weekdays anyway, but it should be like a... Like a day off holiday if I set this up right. Are you gonna open? Thank you. Yeah, so we have the day off work and school. So we are going to spend the entire day uh, with their families, like at the park, having a good time. I'm so excited. Um, I did decorate the park a little bit in anticipation and I wish there was more like outdoor stuff for infants to do. I guess infants in real life don't really do right like they do that they roll around and they crawl um <laughs> but still i feel like infants toddlers they don't have a lot of stuff to do really okay so amaya is going to get herself something to eat um and i think we are winding down for the night after she eats you know and after Knox finishes upgrading the sink i think he's on the second upgrade right now yeah, so after he finishes upgrading the sink, I'll have them clean it too. I'm so sorry, Knox. You're just... Ugh. Nose to the grindstone today, it feels like. Um, but after that, I think we are going to wind down for the evening. And I will see you guys in the morning. Okay, you guys. It is actually bright and early the next morning. Um... I feel like Knox has just been working in this bathroom all day. Everything is going wrong. He's trying to mop up, um, <laughs> but the the shower has apparently broken. Um, I guess if the sink is fixed, the shower has to break. I feel like if the shower breaks, the toilet or the shower's fixed, the toilet's gonna break. Uh, I'm. I thought about giving this this house the. Um, the like gremlin slot tray, and then I just knew I couldn't deal with it mentally. <laughs> So I'm thankful that I didn't, um, so they only have to deal with this every once in a while, hopefully. Um, let's stop mopping until we actually fix the shower. Uh, but yeah, um, we have a little bit of stuff to do before we go to the park for our Freedom Day celebration. Uh, Knox needs to repair the clothing line, and then hopefully we can get, like, a load of laundry done before we go because i don't want them to be running around stinky in like their nasty clothes you know what I oh no see it looks like you know the shower is so bad that it like leaked out from under the floor and now it's out here in the in the hallway Ugh, it's just it's a mess um see and there is our little notification does he love any of these uh yeah so Knox, i don't think he loves any of these <laughs> he ignores the invite grass traditions from being a loner and he ignores the party spirit from being a loner so like you know he's fine he's not gonna streak but he's fine with streaking he's excited for fireworks um or you know he you know fine with fireworks he's fine with drinking but he's not like super psyched about anything um he is going to be a good future hubby and do some laundry so that Amaya doesn't have to when she wakes up. Um, you know, he's like, she works so hard, she does so much, I'll 
pick up the clothes off of the ground for her, you know? I don't want Knox to skip class. All of his classes are on Tuesday and Thursday this week, which I didn't notice. Um, so for a second I thought that he was just going to be in class until like 10, because that's what I thought his last class was. But no, he has classes all the way until 3 in the afternoon. Um, but that I, I still feel like that gives us at least a little bit of time with him, you know? Okay, so we will give Janae a quick bath, and then I think we are going to head to the park after that. I don't want any more time stalling, uh, you know? I want them to have, like, all the time in the world. Oh, so cute. Okay, you guys, we are back at the park. Um, I had to make a few adjustments to Amaya's little outfit you can hardly even notice i just changed her shoes and her hair um because the custom content was like i don't know something about it was like causing problems my game just wouldn't load i had to quit it like three times it was it was chaotic mess but anyway um amaya is here she i mean i had her make a plate of ribs and I think she'll end up needing to make more so let's do that um but we are back here what are you doing I don't trust you. Okay, so Amaya is breastfeeding, but we are back here at Magnolia Park. Um, I decorated it just a little bit for um, Freedom Day. Oh, so if you actually look over here, I have Amaya's whole family here. Also Lori, you know, she's part of the family. Um, and I almost forgot to invite them. So let's invite everyone over. Um, I already invited some of our neighbors because I wanted them to be here. I think they're all, like, on the other side of the park. Yeah, Julia is running around over here. Um, I don't know where everyone else went. Maybe, maybe they're over there skating. Maybe they're getting food. Um, but... Oh, I just, I don't... You know what? Fine. That's fine. Just grill something, please. Or should we do something other than... You know what? She made elote last time before my game exploded. Let's have her make elote again. And then I want to add Lori back to the family. I feel like Lori is just our, like, tertiary caretaker. You know, she's always over here. Excuse me. Hold on. Excuse me. So we're just going to pick up Janae. Is she yelling at us? be insulted Jacqueline what is she insulting us for oh <gasps> what is happening what is she just like cussing us out because she doesn't like our cooking what is that but anyway if you actually look over here this man is Amaya's brother his name is Kevin um I don't know. Knox always felt like an only child, but Amaya did not, and I just felt like she needed some more family. So I just threw together Kevin and his family, who we will see in a minute. Let's call everyone just to meal. Yeah, so everyone can come get something to eat. Anyway, this is Kevin and his wife Mara. She is actually a Simstagram influencer. And they have their son, Sage. And the <gasps> Janae has learned how to crawl. Now she can crawl around everywhere. You'll have to keep a close eye on her. Let me see. Are you going to crawl? <gasps> oh, so precious. Oh, everyone's like looking at her. Oh, she looks so mad. What are you mad about? You're doing so good. What are you mad about? Oh, she's so cute. You need to not be doing this. Stay to school. Oh, um, start school break. I don't care. Can we like talk to Jacqueline and see if we can just? Okay, yeah. Let's try to calm down and then let's bring Knox here now that he is done with school and he can join in on the fun. Let's actually have him make drinks. I think. Let's tend bar. He can just like 
He's like, you know, my wife is cooking. I'll I'll make the drinks, you know? Are we trying to put her down for a nap? What is happening? So this is Amaya's mother. Um, her name is Elizabeth. We don't know what her deal is right now. Right? Like, she's just... Oh, my... Oh. What do we think could have happened here? Is Jacqueline leaving? What? Okay, so, um, I don't know what happened. Um, but whatever it was, uh, ooh. Okay, it looks like all of the neighbors are leaving. That sucks. I wanted them to stay. Um, I don't know, maybe Elizabeth was just, like, causing a scene. Um, that's no good. That's no good. Um, and I want Amaya to kind of, like, talk to her family a little bit. You know? Ooh, what is the ask for a blessing to wed? I think that's from a mod I downloaded. Can we do that? You know, I feel like they got engaged really fast. She didn't really get a chance to, like, talk to Lori. And Knox didn't really get a chance to talk to um, James here. So maybe Amaya so, can do that now and then Knox can do that after. Please don't tell me you're making a drink for the child, too. Sir, the child doesn't get one. I appreciate... Aw, I appreciate that you came to me, but the decision has already been made by the person who really matters. I'm just happy to share it with the both of you. That's cute. I think if no one else is going to drink this, I want Knox to drink this. And then I think he can make a toast, can't he? Okay. What did we just, what did I tell her? This is, okay, so Amaya was just like, I'm so excited for the wedding. Here's everything that we planned. This is where I want to go on my honeymoon. So she's, she's just psyched about it. Um, if Knox can't make a toast, Amaya had the chance to make a toast. I don't know where that went. Anyway, they have, so... Kevin and Mara have a, another child. They have like a toddler daughter. I don't know where she went because I wanted her to like play with um, Janae. I don't know where she is though, but I actually want, can we introduce, wake up little baby. I don't think we've actually introduced Janae to kevin or mara i think it's like you know they live all the way in newcrest so they're they're close enough that they can visit but they don't you know it's not like a go every single weekend say hi kind of thing you know um so i don't think they've actually met janae yet can we introduce her pick up what is, oh, what is Knox doing He's getting in line for the this little shark slider. That's so funny. <laughs> oh, look at him. Oh, he's so smooth. He's so smooth. Oh my god, King. <laughs> Did he meow? Okay. Anyway. So Hill, Knox is going to fix this TV um, so that the family can all like watch a movie together. I know it's a little late for Janae, but like, you know, this is like a whole, this is a whole family thing, you know? Okay, can we not introduce her? Friendly activities. No, we don't need to change outfit. Oh my god, look at look at Kevin over here. He's like double fisting drinks. Sir. No, it is not going to thunderstorm. It was supposed to storm um this entire day and I've just refused. It's not going to start now. You know what? I actually think 
Can her dad, like, be the officiant at the wedding? Can he do that? Does that make sense? You know what, yeah, let's ask him to be officiant. Oh, of course, he's like, of course, I would love to. You're my baby girl. Oh, oh they're so cute. Okay, and like I said, I know it's getting a little bit late, but I wanted them to stay out at least until um, it's dark enough for them to like do some fireworks. And I think we're getting there. Okay, so Amaya is giving a toast. You know, and she's basically just like, thank you so much for coming. This day is so important to us. You know, it's Freedom Day, but like at the end of the day, it's really about family. It's about all of us like getting together to celebrate. And why did I say, why did I say celebrate like that? Getting together to celebrate and just have a great time together and appreciate like everything that we have, everything that we are given, you know, like that's the true meaning of Freedom Day. That's that's Amaya's little confident toast that she's giving, um, you know. And these two are like, okay, we need to get we need to get back to Newcrest. So let's see if we can. Ooh, okay. Let's see if we can light these. <gasps> there we go. Look at that. Oh, those are so pretty. I love that. I told Amaya to light some over here. What are you doing? Okay, at least we can light these fireworks. There we go. There we go. <laughs> Happy Freedom Day, y'all. Ooh. Oh, it's like a smiley face. Cute. <sighs> Ready. Can Nox take a photo? Because he has, like, take a photo. He has the camera. Oh, don't put your baby right next to the fireworks. <laughs> don't put your baby right next to the fireworks. He can take a photo of Amaya. He can't, like, okay, he can't really get a good photo of the fireworks. Yeah, see, I want, like, at least a few cute photos of them. Um, this one's cute. Oh, so cute. Oh, they're so cute. They're so goofy together. I love them. Okay, so all of their food is spoiled. Um, did it, Amaya eat meat? No, okay, so she like made ribs. <laughs> I feel like we need to have like a counter of every single time that I forget Amaya is vegetarian. Um, and oh, Janae looks absolutely stink nasty. Let's wake her up. Let's go home. Let's be done with the day finally. Um, so we're kind of ending off in the same place we left last, last episode. So sorry about that. But I really just wanted them to have a big fun freedom day. Um... But yeah, I think that will be it for this episode, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great rest of your day. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you want to see more of the Kincaid legacy. And I will see you in the next time. Bye!